the Sun Devils didn't get off to the best start of the season on Friday, but with a win Saturday and then again Sunday, they were able to take the series from the Baylor Bears. Let's see how they came up big on Sunday. It was pretty quiet the first five innings other than one run in the second for ASU. Sun Devil starting pitcher Brett Lillick went four innings, gave up only two hits, and had a whopping seven strikeouts. Man, Lillick was good today. You know, um, Lillick was on a pitch count today. I thought he settled in after the first inning, and it was actually, now he's commanding his breaking ball and doing, he was actually pitching. You know, the first inning, it was just lights out, but he settled in and started pitching a little bit, so I was excited about him today. I knew that they were going to try and get our, us starters out of the game as fast as they could, so they were going to be patient, so I know if I... Like in the first inning, I think I started each better out three and two, which was not how I wanted. And then after that, I just figured it out and really helped our team. And, and if I did that, then our offense was going to be relentless and put in some nice work and get run, so I had nothing to worry about. Although the Bears' Lawn Langford scored off of Duncan Wendell's hit in the sixth, the Sun Devils came back the bottom half. ASU scored nine runs off nine hits in the sixth inning. Fourteen Sun Devils were sent to the plate, and every starter but one was able to get on base. And in the seventh, they put two more runs on the board to make the final 12-1 Sun Devils. How about that? I mean, they score one, and it's a tight game. You know, you don't see a lot of one-to-one -one games in the sixth on a Sunday. And then all of a sudden, for us to go out there and have those great at-bats and score nine, it was a it was a relentless attack by our guys. And uh, you know, I was very very proud of them. Sunday's game was an exciting way to end the last ever opening series here at Packard Stadium. What a sixth inning. For Walter Cronkite Sports Network, I'm Adriana Torres.